Mario looks like he just came down from heaven with those light streaks behind him down through the window. Hallelujah. Anyways, hello everyone, this is Argon Matrix, welcome you to episode uh six, maybe, possibly, probably not, whatever. Of Super Mario RPG. And oh there's a save block in here now. It was probably always there and I just noticed it now. What are those things out there anyway? Shysters, duh. Oh you just dude, you just walk through me. No, let me free. Oh no, the Chancellor's still in the throne room. Uh-oh, we better check on him. You may not sleep in the princess's bed. Have you no manners? Uh, did you just completely heal me? That would be cool. Uh, and we'll go talk to this guy, finally. I'm scared. Is Toadstool's question mark still here? No. Damn it. Alright. I wish I could sleep in her bed. You know, who knows what's in there. Maybe she just sleeps naked. <gasps> no. I'm not perverted like that, don't worry. Especially not for cartoon characters. Video game characters, whatever. Right. So let's pass into the throne room. Yeah. Hell yeah. Uh oh. Shy guys. I mean chysters. They're going crazy. Where do you think everyone went? Well gang, looks like we have ourselves a new home. Dude, you can't take over the Mushroom Kingdom castle place. Hey, I see the Chancellor cowering up there at the top of the screen. We could bounce around all day long, and there's no one here can stand in our way. Yahoo, let's bounce the night away. Uh, yeah, you go ahead and do that. I'm just gonna pass on through here. Nope, I guess not. Not so fast, pal! Look at him, can't even bounce. Maybe we could bounce on his head! Oh, jeez, where have we heard that before? Wow, oh. They failed. What the hell, who are you? And why is there a star back there? That's interesting. Listen up, gang! These guys are gonna put a stop to our party! Are we happy about this? You're asking for it! For why? The accent on the it. Ooh, you're gonna get it! Well, I asked for it, so I guess I should get it. You picked the wrong people not to bounce with, bub. How about a fat lip to go with that ugly mustache? Dude! Don't insult my Italian awesome rocker mustache. Anyways, boss battle time! Oh my god. Alright, so, um... Yeah, basically, this is Mac. Uh, I think he's actually weak to the jump, so I'm gonna try that on him. Uh, and it's, de it's decently. And Ma and Mallow, you're gonna use Thunderbolt to, so you can just hit all the enemies, which is quite useful. Even though it's not like super effective against them or anything, it's just it's more than your stupid one damage punch. Anyways, yeah. So basically, four normal shysters. Actually, no, I think they have double the HP of normal shysters, so like 60 HP. But other than that, Max stunned. Oh yeah, he can get stunned from the Thunderbolt. I forgot about that. That's cool. All right, um, we're gonna try out fire on Mac because I just want to see what he's weaker to: jump or fire. Let's see. Or lightning, I guess. Come on, Mario. Uh, it looks like about the same, so I'll just use jump, cause it requires two less P. Yes, slightly less, slightly more power actually for two. For just two less SP. What am I trying to do? Sell you on, like, Mario's jump? No one needs to be sold on Mario's jump. It's the best jump in the land. Flame wall. No! That's powerful. Not really. Just four and three. All right, keep on jumping, Mario. Jump on the knife. You know, jump the gun. Except they just jumped on the knife instead. All right, wow. Mac has lower defense than, like, the Shysters. That's weird. Or else Mal just pones. He pones some noobs with his fists. He, he can crack knives with a fist. Alright, keep on jumping, Mario. Uh, yeah. I guess I'll use a uh, honey syrup since we're getting kind of low on FP. Yummy, honey syrup. Get a freebie. Sweet. I'm getting lots of freebies in this run so far. I think pretty much every item I've used, like, inside a battle was a freebie. So that's cool. Why did I use my hammer? Oh well, it does significant amount of damage. Unlike Mallow. It does three. Oh no, they came back. No! Mallow, you have a use again. You can use Thunderbolt. Yay! Alright. Thunderbolt. Firepower! Jeez, why does Mallow like, make a clover symbol when he uses that? That's weird. Like, what does a clover have to do with thunderbolts in any way? What do you like clover? Oh, he jumped up in the air. 
How peculiar. Let's defend with Mario, because I want him to solely attack Mac. And let's see if we can just take out these shysters with a second Thunderbolt. Yep. The same thing two times in a row, man. And Flame Wall. So he jumped up to do a Flame Wall, is that it? Because that's kind of lame. We bullied him. Come on, are you dead yet? You stoop. Come on, let Mallow kill him. Yeah, four damage. Does that kill him? No. Flame Wall, stop spamming your Flame Wall, dude. Damn it. Uh, we're getting kind of weak here. Uh, Mario, you're still gonna jump. Let's see, Mallow. Oh, we beat him. Yay. That was perfect timing, because I was getting close to being dead there. Be dead. 20 coins and 12 experience. Not too shabby, if I do say so myself, but no level up. And Mac just randomly disappears and... Oh, Star? What's this? It's a nice shade of blue. It's coming right above my head. And... You got a grand star! No. What did we really get? One of the seven legendary stars? From the Legend of the Seven Stars? Oh, it's a star piece. Those are fairly common in Paper Mario, but whatever. Right. This is not good. This is not good. Uh, redundant much? The mustachioed one is strong! The, mus the great mustachioed one. The mustache is the symbol of the samurai. We must warn the boss. Who's the boss? Wasn't that your boss? Mac? You know, Mac and Cheese? Mac attack? Oh. Mario! Once again, Mario to the rescue. The great Super Mario. But who were those? Chancellor! Sir, thank goodness you're alright! Yeah, Spore's alive, he's alright. Mario, it was so it was you who got us through all this. We owe you so- We owe- We owe much to you. Uh, Mario is owed so much throughout all these games. Like, he rescues everybody. Maybe someone else should do the dirty work for a change. First the princess and now this? This is just too much to bear. Mario. How about we ask my grandpa for help? He knows everything. Really? Does he know the square root of pi? Excuse me, but who are you? <laughs> Fail. He's, like, he's just like, who are you? What purpose do you have here? Well, any friend of Mario's is welcome here in Mushroom Kingdom. So if they're not a friend of mine, does that mean they're not welcome here unless they're like a toad or something? Or a toadette? As I was saying, Mario, you're our only hope. Please, Mario, please, you must rescue the princess. Now! Well, I can't do it now. The bridge is still at you, idiot. Mario, I'm in your debt too. Let's head over to Grandpa's place in Tadpole Pond. He can help. I'm sure he can. Wait, why did he even come to the Mushroom Kingdom in the first place? Guess I'll find out soon enough. You most definitely will, because you came for with that coin. Wait, could Mac, the sword-like monster who crashed into the Mushroom Kingdom, have anything to do with the star piece that Mario found? Our heroes move on to the Kiro Sewers. Peace sign. And I guess that's basically the end of the first chapter, even though there's technically no chapters in this game. Uh, can we get the stuff out of the vault again? That would be cool. Doesn't look like it. Wait, maybe? Maybe? I'm standing guard. No, we can't. Never again. Boo-hoo, just those two times. Alright, what do you say now, man? Trample the monsters. Smash them all. It'll do you good. Trust me. On this one. Cool. Alright, so... Um, before we head out to the Kiro Sewers, wherever that is, that the end of chapter sequence text thing told us about, let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Hey, Mala, what kept you? I was starting to worry. Hey, mister. I got my coin back. Got my ba- I got my something back. Oh, well done, lad. Okay, here's the thing I promised you. And we get- Wait, there. Make sure he doesn't get stolen, eaten, or whatever. Your grandpa needs it, okay? Got a cricket pie. Yes, that's very useful. You really, really want to get this, trust me. You bet. Mario, thank you so much. Grandpa will be delighted. Yay. Alright, let me just check my stats here. I'm good on HP so that I don't have to stay in the inn or anything, but I'm gonna go to the inn just to save. I mean, why not? 
Oh man. What time are we at? Ten minutes, wow. Oh, I feel like this has been a boring episode, just a boss fight and stuff, but whenever I say it's a boring episode, it doesn't ever turn out to be a boring episode. Maybe it's because I do say it's a boring episode. Maybe I should say that about all my boring episodes that aren't boring. Boring, abhorring. Right. Our man here on the lookout. Cool. Mushroom sign. Alright. Let's head out not to Bandit's Way, not to Bandit's Way, to Kira Sewers. There we go. And we reached a new section of the world map. That's cool. Let's check it out. Pipe. What in the world? This is the entrance. Grandpa says to watch out for Bloom. Whoever that is. It'll probably it's probably a little dark down there, so keep alert. Well duh, it'd probably be dark in a sewer. Just like that sewer in Majora's mask, you know? Leading to the telescope guy's place. It's pretty dark in there. Alright, um I think I'm pretty much done for this recording session, guys. Uh I've had my fair share of awesome battles and epic commentary. Not too epic, but better than normal in my opinion. Anyways. So I'm gonna just go ahead and save here. Yep. And let's see. Oh, I'm dropping frames like a bitch. Wow. 170. I need to get these settings straight. If anyone can help me with the settings on my Dazzle, uh, cause I ch I've changed the settings around a lot and I'm still getting lag in pretty much every recording session. Hopefully those 171 frames though are like gradual, like not all at once or something. But anyways, thank you everyone for watching. This has been oh so much awesome of a recording session. So, this is Argon Matrix, signing out. Thank you, and good night.